Hi guys, got a bit of an unboxing video today from a company all the way from Turkey, would you believe? And um, they are called Hobium. So this box, not much to look at the moment because I've had to rip off um, all the delivery notes so I can show you what's inside. But uh, they've uh, sent me some yarn to have a look at and it uh, looks really excited to open this. So I've had a sneaky peek at what's inside, but let's have a look, shall we? <laughs> So here we are, so it's hobium.com, if you want to go check them out, and I have no idea what's inside the bag, I had a sneaky peek at the yarn underneath, but let's have a look, that's really heavy as well, really heavy, <gasps> look at all these, are they super cute or what, oh, really, really nice um, set of colours, look at these, so these are 100% cotton, and they are called Mini Cottony Lamia. So premium hand knitting yarns. So we're gonna have a little look at these and have a see what they feel like, see what they smell like even, and have a look at their colors. Oh, look at that pink. That's nice. These look a bit different. These, these don't look like cotton. These look more like acrylics. So we shall have a little look at these. So I'm just going to put this box down, put the camera down and we'll have a look at the yarns. Okay, so I'm going to leave at the box for now because I just want to hold on to the surprise. <laughs> Let's have a look at these ones first and uh, open these up if I can. So these are their little mini balls. Let's take, let's take, let's take some of the blues out and have a look, shall we? So these ones are from the Lamia range and mini yarns. So they're really cute. These are about, we can see on the sides of my hand, like little mini balls, little 10 gram balls. And so yeah, they are 100% acrylic and you get 29 meters of these made in Turkey. So these are 100% acrylic, these ones, and they've got some really, really fun colors. Uh, let's have a go, oh, got a really nice sort of reddy orange color. And Grays and what else? I want to look at this one actually. I dig down some pinks. Yeah, look at the pinks. <laughs> There's some really, really nice, fun colors, and they feel really nice as well. They feel really super soft, so they don't feel like cheap acrylics or um, scratchy or anything like that. They actually feel really nice. So, if I take this out because I like to do the squish factor. Squishy. So, these actually feel really soft. I don't know if you can see on the camera. So although they're acrylic, they don't feel cheap or anything like that. They feel really nice, feel really soft and squishy. So that's their Lamia Mini Yarns, the acrylic ones. So what I'm going to do with all these yarns is uh, I'm gonna come up with some patterns to use these yarns. And I was thinking some amigurumi projects, what do you think? Do you wanna let me know in the comments below what sort of projects you'd like me to make with this yarn? Which one do you think would be your favorite out of this little collection? And I shall do a special video uh, pattern using those yarns. So that's the little 100% acrylic mini yarns in the Lamia range. So let's put those to the side and we'll have a look at their cottons. Now I'm a big fan of cotton yarns. I also do, I like acrylic as well, but I'm a big fan of cotton yarns. I use a lot of cotton yarns. Let's open this up. Let's have a look at these colors. So should we, should we I get them all out? <laughs> I'm such a neat freak, that's like they're so packaged so nicely. So let's have a look at these. They feel really warm as well because obviously they've been in a very warm delivery courier van and uh, they feel really warm, <laughs> which is quite nice. So these are the Lamia range as well. So premium hand knitting yards and these are mini, called mini cottony and they are 100% cotton. And they've got percentage on the left, so the right. <laughs> so these are 25 gram balls, you get 60 meters with these. So these are 100% cotton and they've got a really nice selection of colours. So we got like a really nice lime green and that's like a sort of, I think that's quite accurate actually on camera, just looking around the camera. It's a little bit dark on camera 
but it's quite accurate. So we got a uh, nice purple colour and they've got like red colour and one of my favourites, like a sort of darker pink colour. And so let's open one of these up and have a closer look, shall we? So this is 100% cotton. Camera can focus. And again, it feels very, very soft, very smooth and quite nice squishy. It just feels like cotton. Really, it feels like a nice cotton, quality cotton. I've yet to work with it yet, so we will see how well it works up in crochet um, in our next video. If you choose cotton for me to work with, I probably will. I recommend the cotton. If we do amigurumi, cotton's really good and they've got a really good set of colours. So maybe we could do like a sort of rainbow amigurumi character or something like that using lots of colours. Let me know what you think. So that's their mini cottony yarns and I'm totally messing this up now. I'm making a right mess. <laughs> Stick that in. So there we go. And that's in their Lamia range. So that's nice. So let's have a look at what's in the big green bag, shall we? I'm going to put these to the side. That's a nice colour as well. I like that one. Pink. Ah, they go well together. Oh, wouldn't they be nice together? That'd be nice. Oh, that's a nice colour as well. Should they go well together? See, I'm finding lots of colour combos already. <laughs> I'm terrible. Okay, so let's have a look in this bag. I have no idea what's in here. One thing I will point out, is if you want to follow them on social media, um, it's just Hobium on Instagram. And they've got a YouTube channel as well, so check that out. Looks like they're on Pinterest as well. And they're on Twitter. And I presume they're on Facebook as well. Or Hobium. Or just their website, which is hobium.com. Okay, so let's have a look at what's in the big green bag. No idea. <laughs> I was getting nervous. Oh, look at these. So again, more from the Lamia range. This is a mercerized cotton. So. Have a look at this, shall we? So again, it's 100% cotton. The 50 gram balls, 135 meters. So let's have a look at these. Oh, wow! Again, lots of gorgeous um, colours. Extra large mercerized, 100% cotton. These feel really similar to one of my um, favourite yarns, actually, like the Rico yarns. They feel really similar. Let's have a look. I think there's some other treats in here as well. I just love the colours. I really, really love the colours because you get some really bright colours, really stark colours, which would be great for um, like Christmas time and things like that with the reds, really bold colours. I love that. It's actually surprisingly hard to find, although it's got more common in the last sort of five years. It's really nice to see some more bold colours coming. And, uh, but they've got these really lovely pastel colours as well. So it feels like a nice quality cotton, very smooth. I'll bring it up to the camera. I don't know if you can see, see how nice that looks. It's quite soft, nice squish factor. <laughs> Shall I see what they smell like? See what they yeah, don't smell too bad, they don't smell all chemically. That one actually smells quite nice, that just smells of cardboard because it's been in a cardboard box. So that's really nice, they don't smell all toxic or chemical or anything like that, so that's nice. So that's the uh, Lamia Mercerized Cotton, premium hand knitting yarns, 100% cotton. Um, what else have we got in here? So again, more from the Lamia range, we've got a baby cotton yarn. So this is a premium hand knitting yarn brand. Again, 100% cotton. So this is a baby cotton. This feels, it does feel actually slightly softer than the Mercerized Cotton. It does, it feels slightly smoother. Let's see what colors they got of this one. Um, so these are, so we've got mercerized cotton, we've got this, let's have a look, mercerized cotton, okay, so these ones, there's actually, if I look carefully, we've got mercerized cotton, three of those, but then there's also this luxe mercerized cotton, 
again 100% cotton I'm not sure what the differences are um, I'd have to check that out actually and I'll put details in the I'll put links in the description below to the individual pages so you, so you can go check out what the differences are this one actually the most rise actually feels slightly softer than the luxe nurse rise one but I quite like the bold colors of that one and then this extra large mercerized one. So I don't know if that's is that a different weight yarn. I don't know. So yarn weight of four. So this is like an Aran worsted weight yarn. And this is yeah, so this is actually a thicker yarn than hence the extra large mercerized. So this is an, more of an Aran worsted weight yarn and the Mercerized Con is more of a DK light worsted weight yarn. So I tend to use that more in my videos this way. So that's more of a worsted weight. The Lux one is, that's actually thinner. So that's more of a, um, what's the one that comes before DK? I should know this. <laughs> so it's a thinner yarn anyway. So you're gonna use thinner knitting needles or crochet hooks. It's a yarn weight of two. Is it lace weight, baby weight? Oh, God, why can't I remember? It's the heat, it's gone to my head. So do apologize. Going back to the mini cottons actually. Mini cotton is what weight are they? So they're yarn weight of three. So these are DK light worsted weight yarn as well. Almost like an Aran worsted weight. And the little cotton, uh, the little acrylic ones, again are a DK light worsted weight yarn. So they're a yarn weight of three. So they're all similar. So the extra large ones are obviously more of a thicker weight, more of an Aran posted weight. Anyway, putting those aside, let's have a look at these baby ones that we briefly looked at. And we've also got, there's another cotton ones. So obviously their main um, fiber that they're using for the Lamia range is cotton, which is great for me because I am a huge cotton fan, as I said. Oh, wow, that's nice. I'll show you that one later. Wow lots of different types of ones in here Stick. so let's have a look so it's gonna be a bit of a long video I think so I'm not sure if you like these unboxing videos let me know um, hopefully you enjoy seeing being introduced to something new so they've got these baby cotton yarns as well in the Lamia range and these these feel even softer oh, look at the color of that that is awesome that's such a cool color <laughs> i'm a sucker for lime green it's one of my favorite colors so i don't know if the camera can focus on that you can see it's a much smoother cotton really silky almost silky very very squishy very soft so i can see why that's for the babies and um so this is actually not 100 percent cotton it's actually 50 percent cotton and 50% um, acrylic. You've got a typo there, just thought I'd let you know that. <laughs> Might wanna check that. And uh, it's a Aran worsted weight yarn as well. So it's the same weight as these extra large ones. So it's a thicker yarn. And you get 200 meters, 100 gram ball. I really like the packaging as well, really nice. Which is good. It's not all plasticky, it's just nice, nice paper, it's much nicer. So these are baby cotton ones and it's another one of them. It's like a blue colour. I'm sure they've got shade numbers. Colour lot. So they don't have specific names, just numbers. But if you go to their website, you'll be able to have a look at all their colours. And if there's one that particularly stands out, like the green one, you want to find out what it is, then just ask in the comments below and I'll tell you what the lot number was. Lot number. Is that right? Colour lot, yes. <laughs> and there's a pinky one as well, which is, that's really nice as well. So you see it's almost quite silky, this one. It feels really soft. And again, different colour lots. So there we go, so that's the baby cotton yarn, so an Aran worsted weight. There's also another type of cotton called, I think this is cotton, so I'm just saying it's cotton actually, it's not even cotton, so ignore me what I'm saying. This is actually in the, again, the Lamia range, it's a dye called Diamond, and it's a low pilling yarn. And um, pilling is like, you know, when you put um, some clothes in the wash and eventually they go quite bobbly. 
so low pinning just prevents that as much as possible so it's quite good for stopping it going all bitty which is nice so this is called a diamond in the Lamia range and this one is 70% acrylic and 30% microfiber so there we go and it's an Aran worsted weight yarn as well so it's the same weight as the baby yarn and I've got a couple of these and some really nice pastel colors they go, actually go really well together so I'm thinking um, thinking of maybe like a little baby jacket in that which would be quite nice let me know your thoughts so yeah so that is a diamond that one there so you want a little close up you can see it's almost got this um, almost like a shininess to it and it does feel quite silky and very very squishy all the yarns are actually very squishy I think what was the least squishiest that's a tough one actually they're all they're all very good on the squish factor <laughs> Probably that one is probably the well, that's still quite squishy but it feels a little bit more um textured should we say a little bit more textured that's the right way to say it. but it still feels more still feels very squishy but i would wouldn't recommend that for say baby clothes that would definitely be good for baby clothes they've got that they've nailed that <laughs> this one as well i think would be quite nice as like a little cardigan or something it's got um but it almost has got like a like a shine to it like a sparkle I'm saying light way too much <laughs> so there we go that's the diamond yarn and we've also got another cotton we've got a pastel cotton in the Lamia range pastel cotton pastel cotton and uh, this is 100% cotton and this is actually a yarn weight of five so this is quite a thick yarn so this is going to be equivalent to a chunky or bulky weight yarn not to be confused with super chunky or super bulky so it's, it's a bulky chunky so just one up from a worsted iron weight and this is actually really nice this has got more like a sort of um a woodland sort of um texture to it does that even make sense like a kind of more rustic texture to it but it's not not rough or anything like that it's, it's smooth but it's got more of a um I don't know something that would work really well with like a cardigan or a scarf something like that that's what I feel with that one so that's the pastel cotton really nice colors as well they actually go really well together really good color combos sent to me and this one yeah five yarn weight of five so that's a hundred percent cotton again pastel cotton so I don't do a little close-up of that one my camera would focus so you can see it's got more texture, more of a sort of almost woolly texture, but it's still really smooth and soft. Even though it's a cotton, it feels more like a wool, which is really clever. I don't know if they intended to do that, but it's, I really like that one actually. That's probably one of my favorites. And there's another cotton, so many different types of cotton. Uh, again, in the Lamia range, another 100% cotton. This is called Cottony. I don't think we've I don't think we've done this one, have we? No. Nope. So this is just cottony, and again, it's 100% cotton. Yarn weight of three. So this is a DK light worsted weight yarn, and just really nice colours. Very similar to the other cottons. But if you go to the website and you can read all about the different um, projects you can make with these individual different cottons, what they're best for. So that's the cottony ones. A little close up. They look very similar to the other ones. They feel just as soft. I can't work out which one's softer. <laughs> so nice and squishy. So they're really nice. And last but not least, this is have to be my, one of my favourites. This feels amazing. The silky in the Lamia range. This feels absolutely amazing. I mean, these other ones were soft, but this is a whole new level. What's this made from? So it's made from 100% acrylic microfiber. So that's quite interesting. Um, 100 gram ball, 300 meters. It's a yarn weight of two. So it's again, it's the one smaller than DK Light Worsted, which I can't remember. And I'm sure you'll all correct me in the comments below. And uh, yes, yeah, so this is made from acrylic microfiber. So I'm really surprised that this is an acrylic because this literally feels like silk. It really does. Feels amazing. Really soft. Got a couple of colors here. So if I can zoom in, it's got a lovely sheen to it. Really nice and shiny. And it's super, super squishy and soft. So this is beautiful. This would make an absolutely stunning shawl or scarf, um, something like that. And uh, I'd imagine, even though it's a yarn weight of two, and it recommends a size for hook actually, a two, two and a half. 
millimeter but I would actually I would be really naughty and actually almost go up to a four crochet hook say a 3.5 or a four and you'll get an amazing drape with this I think yeah I'd be very tempted to give that a try so that is all the yarn that was sent to me so quite a lot of cottons and some really interesting different textures and and uh, colors and there's a few other bits and bobs in the bag as well so I'm just gonna have a little look at those let's see what we got ah so it looks like they also make crochet hooks in the Lamia range as well this Lamia range is it's just awesome to be honest with you it's really 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 quite stunning this is a handmade crochet hook as well made from rosewood and this looks absolutely beautiful this looks really really lovely I don't know if you can see this let's so take it out of its little box so it's made from rosewood it's a six millimeter size crochet hook our hooks are handmade one by one from Honduran mahogany, the silky smooth finish, lightweight body and perfect tip, giving you the most enjoyable crocheting experience. Only available at hobiumyarns.com. There we go, made in Vietnam. So this oh, it feels absolutely beautiful, it's lovely. So yeah, it's a six millimeter crochet hook and it feels really smooth and I'm gonna be giving that a try. Which is really nice actually because I have bamboo hooks um, but sometimes I find them a little bit too uh, rough to work with sometimes so it'd be really interesting to try a different type of wood um, standard sort of shape crochet hook that'd be really nice so there we go so they do a range of crochet hooks as well by the looks we'll put that in there and also what else is in here so they also another crochet hook in the Lamia range handmade crochet hook this is made from white wood 3.5 millimeter one this time let's have a little read so same as what it, the other one said in Vietnam so let's have a look, look at this one as well that's really nice feels really nice so I think I prefer this one though I think maybe that's just because I prefer the darker wood but um, yeah, just as beautiful. It'll be really interesting to give a try crocheting with those. What's actually quite cool is all the yarn. They've sent me hooks that go really well with the yarns they've sent. I think they've thought about that. Because <laughs> when I do the um, patterns, I can use their crochet hooks and see, and um, do a little review of their crochet hooks as well, see how well they work. But I'm quite impressed with those. And um, let's see what else has got. They are truly spoiling me. Let's have a look. I think that's pretty much it. And it looks like there's like a little pom-pom maker as well to try and uh, oh there we go look a couple of stickers love hobium <laughs> yep I, def I think I do actually and I think I love your Lamia range so um but yeah super cute um, if you'd like to know more about Hobium and their cotton ranges and the rest of their Lamia ranges, then do check out their website at hobium.com or hobiumyarns.com. So that's H O B I U M yarns.com. A little bit of extra. Um, they take uh, both PayPal and credit card. Um, and you receive a 20% discount on your first order, which is good. And um, there's free shipping over $150 um, dollars, US dollars uh, in Europe and North America. So you get, uh, they give free shipping if you spend over $150, which to be honest is going to be quite easy to do when you think about it. <laughs> I'll put a link in the description below to send you directly to their Lamia range. And, uh, and yeah, I'm also I have to say pretty fast delivery. So that was, I was quite impressed with that pretty quick delivery and uh, well packaged so thumbs up from me <laughs> go check them out and uh, I'll see you soon for some more crochet fun and let me know in the comments below what sort of patterns you would like me to try with these yarns what you think would go well with the different types of yarns and uh, I'll do some videos for you some patterns for you giving them a try thanks for watching